Good afternoon, I'm Anne-Marie LaFlame and here are your headlines from 7 Action News. General Motors bringing jobs and new vehicle production to the city of Detroit. The company investing $2.2 billion in the Detroit Hamtramck assembly plant. This will be GM's first plant fully devoted to making electric vehicles and will create more than 2,200 manufacturing jobs. President Trump will be making a trip to Michigan this week. A spokesperson for the auto supplier Dana Incorporated confirmed the trip to 7 Action News. The president is scheduled to appear Thursday afternoon at the company's facility in Warren. The visit will take place one day after President Trump is expected to sign the U.S.-Mexico-Canada trade agreement. We're still waiting from the White House to hear exactly the details of the president's visit. So stay with 7 Action News for the very latest. Also today, flooding in a neighborhood where people have felt trapped in their own homes. City workers are checking out the problem on Quincy Street on the west side that flooded in the area of Livernois and Finkel. City crews came out last week to clear the street, but the problem has returned, and the Detroit Water and Sewage Department just told us that workers will clean the streets just like they did before, and of course, we'll keep you posted on exactly what's happening with the progress in that area. Let's check in now with Hallie for a check of your forecast. Well, it's going to be a lot of cloud cover for today. Temperatures in the mid 30s, but still running above average will drop down to 28 degrees under a mostly cloudy sky, maybe a little drizzle in a couple of spots or even a few flurries. And that carries over to Tuesday with temperatures in the mid 30s, a little cooler on Wednesday, still above average 34 degrees, mid to upper 30s as we wrap up the week. And we'll be watching a system come in next weekend. Could be rain and snow Saturday and Sunday. All right, Holly, thank you. Well, today, one brave pup is being hailed a hero in Shelby Township. Canine officer Morpheus was honored for his efforts in capturing a suspect who stole a car and ran from police in a high-speed chase. The ceremony was held this morning at Marcus Grill, where Shelby Township's police chief and Morpheus's trainer were there to celebrate. A good boy. Great job there. And those are your headlines from 7 Action News. Don't forget, the news is on WXYZ.com and the 7 Action News mobile app. I'm Anne-Marie LaFlame. Have a great day.